Well, it took me a few minutes to get started. And after I started, I kissed goodbyes, but that's my family. I love them so much. Bye. The biggest challenge I noticed right away is um, finding a, a way to get from, I'm gonna call it the south end of the Lost Rivers to the north end, which everyone else kind of goes the opposite way. Um, because I had to find a way to connect the valley from the Lemhi's, deciding how I was going to tie all this together. Diamond Peak Summit. I knew there was a, a lot of people younger than me that could probably hear about the challenge and go out the next weekend and do it. Out in the hot desert. Approaching 50 years old, I wanted to make sure my cards were Just putting the miles on stacked in my favor, and so uh, I wouldn't have to do it more than once. Oh, there's my family. Oh, miserable. Hey, Mama. Mom, get our photo. <laughs> <laughs> Well, that was quite graphic, but I feel much better. My legs are still shot. My body feels better. I'm approaching Lost River Peak. About an hour behind schedule. Actually, almost two, because I got up late. I couldn't sleep last night. I came from down there. Peak number two, after 24 hours. What was really challenging for me once I reached the Lost River Range was the quality of the rock. This is Mount Breitenbach. I'm gonna describe it as rotten. It was very inconsistent. It sucked. You really had to pay attention. It was pretty challenging to just uh, really stay focused to not get hurt. This is the top of Donaldson. This is uh, Mount Church. I gotta get to the top of Leatherman before dark. I think sleep deprivation really started paying its price on me. I don't know if it was the altitude or that, but just to think straight sometimes was kind of a challenge. Mm. Well, I'm on the peak of Leatherman, trying to find something to sign. I'll sign it right there. 9, 3, 17, Kevin Lance. We're at Pass Lake. This is Doug Lawton. Come to save my life. My feet are hammered. Rocks falling above us, so I'm getting out of dodge. We got a new book. That's Mount Idaho, white cap in the middle, Leatherman down there in the far end. It's Chicken Out Ridge. I got some company for number eight. This 
so going on two and a half days with no sleep except for an hour this morning hopefully nobody else is crazy enough to try this but I'm close enough I gotta try to finish it I gotta My daughter's names, I have nicknames for them. I call them Chuck and Bob. And when it gets hard when I'm going uphill, I'm always looking down and I see their name one after another. I got my son on there too and holding. And so you can be thinking about something that's getting you off track and look down and there's a reminder. This is it. I'm at the top shortly after and for quite a while I wondered why <laughs> and I thought I would have this answer sitting for me in the top of Hinman Peak and I'd be lying if I said Sorry. I wouldn't want to do it faster or I wouldn't want to do it the other direction hey I'm I'm calling you from the top I love you thanks for everything I'll see you in I don't know three hours <laughs> bye I love you It took a big effort from me and my family. It was a thousand percent worth it.